cause. That's what a lot of you want to know. Months after a major fire destroyed the Department of Public Works building in Irondequoit is the subject of this week's Good Question Report with Pat Taney. Pat, still a lot of questions on this. I keep getting emails about this one. You know, it's been five months, Christmas Eve to be exact, when flames ripped through the DPW building. And for the first time, we're finding out the final report from investigators. The fire intense. More than 100 firefighters called in. Millions of dollars in equipment wiped out. We know where it started. Fire started in the engine compartment of a large truck that was in the South Bay. But what ignited that engine compartment? I reached out to the Monroe County Fire Bureau, which closed its investigation. The final determination? Undetermined. They're saying the final report is undetermined. Really, no conclusive decision as to what sparked the truck. The Monroe County Fire Bureau also told me that undetermined doesn't necessarily mean accidental. Any worry or concern in your mind that something happened here that shouldn't have? No, and we, we were, I was very upfront with both our chief of police and the district attorney's office that if, so, if there was foul play or human, a human element here, we wanted to know. Um, they've determined that there really was no human cause or something that was uh, uh, intentional. The town's insurance company, though, is still investigating as the town gets ready to build a new facility on this piece of state owned land near 590 in the 104 Ridge Road corridor. I hope uh, by spring next year uh, we'll be breaking ground and hopefully opening up in 2019. Are you confident you're going to get reimbursed? Fully by the insurance company. It's not going to be the cost of a new modern modern highway garage, but we'll we'll find ways to, to pay for it through other means. Do you think uh, you don't think it'll impact taxes then at all? My hope is no. Another thing undetermined: the total amount of money lost in this fire. Again, insurance adjusters are still working to determine that. The town looking at buying mostly used trucks to replenish its fleet to get them at a lower cost. If you have a good question, I'd like to hear from you. Send me an email: goodquestion at whec.